And that's the place I was staying now. This tower of beers there was all. Ooh. It's about 20, 24 degrees at the moment. So this is pretty, <laughs> pretty nice. Still have a little bit of time for the check-in, so I'm gonna walk around a little bit. Never been on this street before. So the beer cost me there about 290. Two sixty, two ninety euros, something. something like this. Fair. Not the cheapest, obviously, if you want some random local bar. This may be half of that price. Because I had a craft beer, that's why it's a little bit more expensive. You can see what's happening up there. Let's get this soil now. Traffic. Right, okay. Missing my chance here. I'm fucking falling asleep. Ooh. Upstairs, upstairs, upstairs. Oh my god. Oh, oh, nice grassy area here. Very nice. Come on, I didn't come up here last time. But it's good, so I always have something more to discover. So otherwise it'll be not very nice to go to the place where you have seen everything, so that's good. Summer is here. This feeling is walking on the grass. It's already like so good. The nature is wonderful. It's a massive kind of castle of waters. Good one. Found a nice spot top of the hill there is arena and also a beautiful mountain range covered with snow snow you know and the riverside we have there it's water looks so it's it's <laughs> green But yeah, bus came that way somewhere across the bridge, so I don't remember that river part at all. And the outskirts of town, I think there's only like just big, big buildings and maybe a few parks. This is how it is in Balkans. Mustafa Pask. And this is the bastard. Probably certain times a day, he'll be going crazy with his songs, like in Turkey as well, early morning and later at night. So it's not so long, but still, it's like very, very noisy. All the carpets are piled up there. You have to take your shoes off as well. These are like pretty much empty buildings here, must see there. Yeah, it's just a hole. Just 
check out if they have some city views at least there. Haven't been walking around the outskirts of Skopje much. So this is an all new area for me. Well, just to just like that. There's quite a lot of these mosque things. Everywhere. Yeah. Resort and spa is there. I think there's a lot of uh, Turkish people live here. Because uh, as I see the normal people well, the normal Macedonians, they don't seem to really, uh, you know, go crazy about this kind of praying and, and they are just like Europeans. Crazy Europeans. But the buildings are beautiful, so it's interesting, the culture is always interesting to see. You can wash your feet there. Well, I need some flip flops. <laughs> so, the toilet paper as well. Wow. Very interesting stuff. Maybe even too interesting. Well, most of them are looking quite the same. Of course, in Istanbul you had some very, very big ones. It's like a really nice ones. They have a special park for rocks as well. No humans allowed, so I keep my distance. beautiful rocks they are don't lose your head head is already in my back <laughs> found some very interesting architecture so this is next to my 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 apartment it's very kind of different I don't know what it is ah oh, it says museum there's a mosque up there as well brutal a <laughs> long time no see there is the masterpiece of them all should be statue of the fucking cock as well there that'll be fucking good is it <laughs> Wow. All right. There's another ruins. This big building it goes all the way, all the fucking way it goes. And there's some ruins. Very fucking interesting. Well, this is old. I located my apartment as well because the owner sent me a picture it's not the yellow one I had seen before it's next to it it's also looking new I don't care actually how it looks outside as long as the insides are okay so I'm gonna chill now about 20 minutes we have time hopefully he's in time on time that will be good you know what that's very interesting stuff also haven't seen that before kids park kids only have to go Own low 
Oh, this is very nice. Very old. Very nice old looking building. And then you have your shopping cart. And this is the cute building. Where is my apartment? Number 16, the grey one. Before I thought it's this one. Maybe the balcony is on the other side. I hope there is. Sometimes it's written, but it's not there. So I will wait here about 15 minutes now because the back's getting heavy and I have still, still, the whole, oh fucking hell, still have all evening ahead. And it's, it would be nice to have some short pants on and go bagless. Take my bra off as well. I think it's sweaty fucking tits. Anyway, here you can see the Macedonian car registration. So it's looking like that. Eska is for Skopje. Finally got changed for better clothing. Because it's fucking hell, 5 o'clock and it's already like uh, 25 degrees. Real nice. Now I'm going to the city center. Well, actually, I am already in the city center. Was in the old town part. I checked into my apartment as well. The guy came exactly uh, 10 past 4, and it's very, very uh, nice inside. I'll show you later on. And it's like 500 uh, years old uh, building. So that's the guy's grand. Grand, uh, uh, grandfather's place and it's on three levels so this is really very interesting stuff there For 22 euros per night okay I'm not gonna talk about this more because I'm not able to show you now so in few hours I'm gonna stay outside until the darkness because it's getting too nice and so you so you will see how the city is looking in the evening as well. If I have to compare the Sofia city center and Skopje city center, then Skopje definitely wins that round. For sure. Some more statues here. Another fountain. This is a riverside, so city center is back there. I think Sofia doesn't even have the old town part. It's just randomly old, but I don't think so. Yeah, because the Macedonia one, this is like a ancient stuff, you know. And look at that, this is like, wow. I'm drinking the sparkling water. Fucking hell, nearly dropped it. <laughs> Fucking hell. Oh, look at that Soviet building here. This is a beautiful. And look at the masterpieces here as well. This is a fucking first class Picasso. Now I'm going to the big supermarket because in the old town there's not really uh, happening any big supermarkets. Because last time I went to some small ones and small ones are expensive. But check them out. The Vero center is here. Fucking sparkling water. That's really wow. Usually I have normal water. But the, Day I decided that was popping one. I don't know why, but uh, never mind. Fucking finish it in five minutes. That's it. Now let's go and see what they sell in the supermarket. Wow, it seemed to be huge. Well, the shopping mall as well. I'm not very interested in that one at all, but I want to check the supermarket out. 
This is really big. Very nice. Hopefully they have everything here. This place is huge. Very nice. Not too crowded either. Today's Friday about six o'clock. But really enjoy that shopping. We have some bread, some uh, pepper mix, uh, classic one, banana and the avocado as well. Let's check out what's going on here. So millions of people are asking me always uh, how much is the beach nectar in Macedonian supermarkets and here is your answer. 65 for uh, I think it's two liters yeah there you go so here we have the beer selection so you got some local ones here this is I think new one well I haven't seen them three four years but so I don't know really but I don't remember that one 42 so 61 is one euro uh, well, Heineken, no thank you, another Heineken, oh Lasko, okay, this is also good, pretty good price, Amstel, not my style really, so you have some small ones as well, Tuborg, Slatendab, might try this one. Have the bottles and then your Peronis one more fifty. Combinate so ELM. Oh, this is I remember. Some Italian beer as well. X as well. A lot of Heineken to work here. So but there is a beer shop as well, I checked, Croft. I think this didn't exist about 3-4 years ago. We'll check that out later on. I was thinking I'm gonna go inside this uh, abandoned ship. Uh, but it's a little bit too exposed here. Although, I saw some guys on the top floor but I don't know if they were there just random strangers or maybe the captain <laughs> captain is there fuck knows captain woke up in the morning to say fucking hell what happened to my fucking ship someone had a fart blew all the windows out but yeah I announced that you could go inside there but uh, fuck this you know it's uh, yeah. Never mind. Okay, here is some flowers. And statues again. <laughs> I'm gonna repeat all the same things again. <laughs> walk, <laughs> walk back somewhere. In the city center, to sit down and wait until it's dark. Wow, find some, found something that I like. Check out this whole pharmacy. This is like from the movies or... Yeah. <laughs> Real beautiful. And that's... Uh, some kind of shopping area, I think. I've never been here before. Well, that pharmacy made my day, for sure. And those who are thinking that, oh, I don't know, sh should I come to the Balkans, uh, shitty and cheap and... Well, go to your fucking Paris, then, if you like. But here, in Skopje, we also have that fucking... Triumph of Ark. And also shitty building as well next to it. That's a cherry on a cake for me, obviously. And that is just a, just an arc, arch, or what is, it, what is it? I don't know, I don't care. But it's nice, anyway, also nice to see that. 
example where I am. Well, probably in Skopje still. I recognize this area. They like the big statues here. There's some probably some writers again. Here, let's go up. It's really real big. I, I don't remember seeing anywhere. That kind of and this one here as well, out of nowhere. That is Soviet shit. For sure. Macedonia Square, alright, that's the main one. And there's a park I've never been into. Some horses as well, and there is some pillars. Another horse. Well, I'm gonna check out the statues here because this seems to be a very interesting kind of park. What we have here? Pizza Pan. Yeah. This is really fucking massive. Oh, my bag is full of beers. I bought about six of them. All cheaper ones and the famous ones. I didn't buy any, I don't know. They didn't have any. Whatever, I don't want to spend too much money really on that fucking beer here, so. Although I don't have many other expenses. And here is the uh, long-faced four-legged bastard. Gee, that park is beautiful. I drink a beer here for sure. Wow. I'm happy I didn't uh, stay last time here like one week, you know, and or or four days. You could see everything. I think I was two nights in here, and still I have. Uh, it's nice to come back and discover more things. Nearly all green, grass is green. Some trees take a bit of time. Immortalis, immortalis, let's say. Statue after statue. There's another statue after that one as well. Here is your old ding dong here. And the golden boy. Ooh. Is it golden boy? Looks like golden boy. It is golden for sure. Can't complain about this hot dog. I'm only going to this corner here because then I get lost. Nah, but it's too far otherwise. I don't want to get too far. And here we have some uh, Soviet shit, obviously. And there you have already some, uh, well, just the random big buildings. So this is not the area I'm really interested to see. I don't think Skopje has many abandoned locations. As far as I read online. But there's one there. Well, it's under construction, you know, but still. It's old and shitty. One more time. Now, the better view of that French bastard. Here we have the big arch there. And there's a guy just sitting there. Doing nothing. Now, let's walk a bit. Walk this way. I remember, that's, that's the street where I had my hotel. So it's still a pretty good location. Only about... Uh, four or five minutes from the Macedonian uh, square. 
where I'm heading now if I don't get distracted by some other fucking Soviet shit now there is the horse already in the square and there's a guy he's a fucking big guy imagine how, how much uh, how many beers he can drink he's fucking sitting there <laughs> I bet he's sitting there tomorrow as well it would be interesting tomorrow is someone else there sitting Okay, got to the construction site. I am heading to the square. Square of the world. The big horse kind of thing. Is that horse kind of uh, animal? <laughs> How the hell they got this up there? Very interesting. There's the Paris. Ah, the other. Okay, this is the abandoned building. Well, it is abandoned now. Good stuff. And that's the old town over there. Coca-Cola City Gallery and There you have these cafes all lined up But I think I'm gonna go back to this uh, beer Yeah, I'm going to I'm going to go To this beer place where I was before and I want to eat something because they have some chicken wings there, they have some soups there, very decent prices. So I want to check them out. Another statue there. Tomorrow I will explore that area there because I can't be bothered now. Although this is the area I know the most because of the last times. Let's go a bit closer to the fountain because this is really beautiful. There you have it, the fresh water. Oh my god. It's dripping from the top as well. Very interesting. Oh. And there's an interesting building, another statue of course. Oh. Another construction there as well. So I think it's that never never gonna finish. It's interesting, you know, you have the square, half is half is done and half is like proper run down fucking motherfucker yeah i think this motherfucker is the right word for that sure but the square is beautiful here the bridge and all these things are like oh. my kind of square Let's go over the bridge now and see what's waiting for us there. For a change, I'm gonna cross the third or fourth bridge today in Skopje already. So that's the one here, which is a bit more modern. Still good looking. And this is the stone bridge. There we can see another boat as well. This is the last third one. No more boats. Enough is enough. And these pillars here as well are fucking huge. Real deal that is. Wow, this is really out of this world. This, uh, I don't know if in the video it's really, you can see that it's really big. Massive. And this is the new one. 
New Bridge. Nobody likes the uh, New Bridge. Everyone's going over there. Well, anyway, this one is going straight to the old town. So I understand. And here is the, the ship. That is... If this will be abandoned, but it's better to explore because it's a little bit in a better location. Oh, and there is the arena I saw from the hilltop. It's a castle, it's a round building, which is nice. It's some very, very Soviet. Probably my finger made it all uh, foggy, so. No more pointing the fingers. But it's very, very cool, that one. And there, so many statues on the roof on that beautiful building. The river is moving pretty pretty fast I don't think it's too deep I'm not gonna try either some car parks On the other side Oh, there's a nice statue. Woman with a harp. This might be the highlights of the day. One of the highlights of the day. Might be some sort of a museum. Uh, no, it's a uh, theater. Yeah. Yes, this is theater. Has to be a nice one. Look at that. It's a masterpiece. And this guy is just a fucking cunt. Man whore, I'd say. This boat looks a bit different than the other ones. Doesn't even look like a boat from there, more like a flat, block flats. Yeah, there's here, Soviet buildings are there. Nobody here. It's very quiet, I don't know. It's about seven now. Should be dark in about an hour, so I can take a another uh, video I'm around here from the bridge as well if I'm already out but maybe I should leave my bag in a I should leave my bag in the yeah in the room definitely it's better like this because it's getting heavy and it's nicer without the bag <laughs> heaven's fuck is this one Something's cooking. Wow, this is interesting. Nice. I arrived to my room in the apartment. The old bazaar, bazaar. Oh, I'm gonna put some stuff in the fridge and get rid of the bag and go outside. But here we have a very nice looking living room. Okay, let's get this sorted. All right, here we go. That's pets of you. You got TV here. You got the soft cooker. Nice sofa. This is only one room now, so uh, there's more. 
So fridge is here, the kitchen area, and down here, this is, well, this is a bathroom as well. This is very good to have a bathroom like this. But down here, there is a, ah, never mind, I show you already now then. I was thinking to go there here later. But here we have a shower room. So this 500 uh, years old building. Well, you see, is how it is, but I don't mind. This is all right, you know. For me, is okay. Of course, it's like a basement. It's a bit damp there as well, but you know, take a shower, five minutes, I'm done. That's it. <laughs> ah, you bastard. It's very interesting. So these are very kind of steep stairs. I have to be careful here. Maybe I sleep downstairs. I don't know because it's more like cozy. This is nice room as well. It's a very good room. Nice curtains. That's the old street. And there we go. Yeah, and downstairs is okay to sleep as well. And I have to be real careful here now. Uh, slip, slip. Whoa, man. Wow. Well, that's it. This is my cute apartment. 44 euros per two nights. So 15 till 17th of April 2022. Not bad. The evening has arrived in Skopje. Now I'm gonna have a little walk around in the bridge area. See how the lights are. Just add two beers in that uh, microbrewery pop and chicken wings as well. So that was altogether 530 local money. And this is uh, 860 euros, it showed me. That's pretty good price. One uh, was a large IPA, one was a small local beer, and chicken wings were very, very delicious. Nice wall, the trees growing there. See if I can get down from here. I'm not sure. Ah, from the other side, maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Yeah, this should be the way. And the newer part of the city center is right over there. Now I'm on the stone bridge and the newer bridge is over there which is lit up but the other bridge with the statues well there is yeah the lights are in the further one and on that building as well the big one but the middle one has no lights on at the moment but the big one is looking good. And the uh, main square of the city is well lit up as well. There's a cross on the top of the hill. Beautiful. <laughs> Moon's out. Very nice. It's 
stone bridge has the lights on as well. <laughs> if I have a beer every time I say as well, I'll be dead already. A few lights there. And this is the Archaeological Museum of Skopje. Let's check out the bridges. And the ship is on fire as well. <laughs> One pint of beer. I bet there's a nice restaurant. Oh, did I have a terrace? <laughs> this is really good. The evening here is wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. Not sure what's this big dome building there. There, here you got the uh, Macedonian flag, which is quite funky. I like it. And these lights are off as well. Maybe they <laughs> they have too many lights in the city. Maybe they are trying to save some electricity because this is a lot. <laughs> And now the best part, the beautiful lit bridge with the, uh, looks like the proper seagull shit on ahead, I'm not sure, maybe it's not the shit. Very nice. Most lights are on. And I bet if you are in the main bridge uh, in Prague, I think this is packed with people. It's nice as well, but I think this one is better. So what is this building then? Higher public prosecutor's office copy. Okay. Give it a closer look. That's what it is. And beautiful magnificent bridge. This is relaxing. Something going on in the arena. Ah, oh, that's the Spice Girls concert. Well, I was in this pub before when I had chicken wings and there were Spice Girls playing as well. Pint of beer. Best of Spice Girls. Madame, may I? Thank you. No. For a change, let's go this way. Oh, there's an opera today. Mm. I like the buildings, uh, how they look. The, the well, this. This is the Soviet kind of uh, opera building, but I'm not into the opera or theater stuff. Never been really. I've seen a few plays, but it's really nice. Not my 
a pint of beer. <laughs> I prefer the concert, a good old concert. Heading back to the old town now and to my apartment. There is another statue. Right now is 8 o'clock and it's not cold. You can even sit on a terrace and have cold beer with a t shirt on. Very nice. And this is the old town part in the evening. That was this part here was more lively in the afternoon. There's not many places which are open here. One pop, perhaps. And the more I get to my, the closer I get to my apartment. Ah, oh, it's dead already. Well, this is more like a market. Market area. So there's like no bars here. At least now, maybe in, in summertime there will be more. But now, there's nothing. Beautiful cafe here. Very creek looking that is. And here is the area with all the uh, jewelry shops in the afternoon. No bars whatsoever, so it's all dead quiet. Ah, oh, they removed all the things as well. Oh, it's gonna be... Well, yeah, obviously they are, are on trays, so it won't be a huge work to put them all back. Here are a few cafes located. Didn't think that would be that quiet, but, but here there's a lot of... Not sure, maybe that is my street here. I have to check it out. Yeah, because they're in this area, there's more like Muslims. So they don't really uh, party. They don't really party. Oh yeah, that is my... That is my apartment. Alright. Ah, now it's time to chill. Had two remote TV. Worked straight away, didn't have any problems. So hopefully when changing, changing the channels, I'm not gonna use the wrong remote because that can fuck up <laughs> everything as well. I just uh, checked, I walked 17 kilometers today. So it was a good day. Early start, I had to wake up five o'clock and actually I was awake already 4 a.m. But uh, yesterday after nine, I was only laying down in a sofa and <laughs> just uh, chilling, listening to some music, which I'm gonna do now. And after a few hours, we'll call it a night.